Hey guys, Gameboy3800 here once again, and today, box. A fairly big box, actually. I'm not even sure what's in here. It's probably something from my dad because he orders stuff too. But I guess we're gonna find out today. This here is a sound card, obviously. I like how it's in a mini PCI card. Page plate. This here is a GT640 um, GPU. That will come in handy. This here is a liquid cooling unit. So liquid cooling unit that yet says Alienware on it. That's what I'm waiting for. Now it's packing chance. When will we ever love you? Answer is never, because we always hated you. Forever alone packing peanuts. Okay, memory is in place already. Packing peanuts. Quite a lot of them, actually. Good thing I didn't spill. Good thing I opened it up the right way. But, what is in here? Some packing film stuck to the bottom. Here we go. Backing away. In here is the. In here is the motherboard to an Alienware Aurora R2. So that means it's got an Intel Core i7 920 quad core processor overclockable. And it's got dual video card slots, so SLIs, um, you can do SLI with this. It's got 8 gigabytes of RAM right here. No, 6 gigabytes of RAM, my bad. 246. And now I'm wondering if you show the same speeds. No, they're different. I was hoping that these would also fit, but... These are PC 10800 10600U. These are 10600R. They won't work. I don't believe so, anyways. I'll try it out, but I don't believe they will work. So, yeah, Aurora R2. You may have an idea what's going, what, what this is going into. And I'm actually going to get one of my fan things, cut it open. And I'm going to unplug this fan right here. Plug it 
position and there we go I now have another case fan socket I'm wondering if I should do that again to this part why so that I can hook up all the case fans of another alien or computer I have this is going to be a fun build but yes this is what I was expecting it came much earlier than expected and I cannot applaud the guy enough so yep that's it for this video thanks game way out see you next time